Yeah, right. Yeah, right. Oh, it's going YouTube. One only X Fam here, riding a fucking Zero SRF. <laughs> so quiet. <laughs> Alrighty, so again, zero F S R F. Uh, let's see, is a 14.4 volt motor, all electric motorcycle, and I tell you what, already it's super comfy, super super easy to ride. It's very very smooth. I am told that it has 140 foot-pounds of torque, which is a fuck ton. And most of all, it is dead silent. Right now I have it in sport mode, apparently it's eco. The amount of engine braking and everything else that this thing has, uh, due to the electric motor, is impressive. Okay, here we go. It's so weird to not shift. <laughs> it is instantaneous torque. It is just a beast. We're going to talk about comfortable bikes. I think this one's more comfortable than that one. <laughs> Holy crap. This is nuts. It is, makes you recalibrate your brain. Because right now I'm off the gas and I'm engine braking right now. And it's doing a lot for me. The good people at on any moto put me up with this <laughs> it's so weird <laughs> you want to shift <laughs> so the really cool thing about electric bikes is it's one gear it's one continuous thing so there's no shifting you don't have to worry about stalling uh, like I said, you have to recalibrate your brain because every time you come to a stop, you're used to, you know, pulling the clutch in and everything else. You know, I, I'm not missing the motor noise with this motorcycle. Uh, once you understand what it is, you, you don't miss it as much because you actually, it raises your senses for everything else. You know, because my bike's so loud, it deadens the senses for all the things. It deadens your senses because there's just, just that drone of the engine and exhaust where this one, you feel the you hear the breeze you feel the road you can hear other vehicles like Hef's bike is uh, stock exhaust and it's relatively quiet but I can hear him shifting <laughs> I can hear him click I can up and down and the gear shifts which is incredible just I'm impressed by the comfortability of this the ride quality of this motorcycle um, the previous Z's uh, the zeros they're rather narrow and it felt kind of small to me. This feels, this feels like uh, maybe a little less wide than his 800, Z800. So it, it feels proper, it feels, it feels right. So he wanted me to change modes between sport and eco to really feel the engine braking. I think I might do that uh, later here. We'll see, I don't have a ton of battery left. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Holy crap. The torque on this thing is insane. You whack it? Holy balls is that a lot. It's just instantaneous. It's like you're cruising, you don't really think much of it, and then just whack the throttle and it will go. Holy shit. Alrighty. Let's see if we can open up ah, get some holy god is that easy holy shit balls oh man the center of gravity on this is incredible it just keeps pulling the power I do not like the brakes 
the brakes are not great. However, you let off the gas, it slows way down for you. It is fantastic. Oh man. Whew. Just instant, dude. It's so effortless. There's there's no spool up, there's no revving out, there's none of that. It's just you turn the throttle and it goes. It's not brutal either. It's not brutal. It's not a brutal change. And she handles corners very well. It, it's surprisingly nimble. I would not have expected it to be this nimble. I, I, I will say if we upgrade the brakes a little bit, it, this bike would be flawless. Absolutely flawless. You want to shift and grab another gear. There's no need. <laughs> oh my god <laughs> this is fun I don't know man I think they got it right on this bad boy I think they did zero kudos the speed and the delivery of the speed of this machine is incredible man it's, ins it's so smooth now it's actually very linear and very smooth as you would expect an electric motor to be oh man oh you gotta hang on to this thing Christ <laughs> Right now, I'd be shifting down and down and down, but you don't need to do that. You really don't need to do that. Part of me wants to shift down because I'm afraid I'm going to stall out. It's just not the case. It just is not the case. I want to shift. I want to shift. Oh, Christ. What a blast. Now, I don't want to completely destroy the battery because Mr. Head 520 is going to get a go on this bad boy and a go he will have so what are my impressions of this beast already one very comfortable very nice upright riding position if you need to duck down you can the ergonomics your, your elbows are down it's really comfortable in that regard there's a decent amount of leg room being six foot even uh, I feel like it's a very roomy rear set to, to knee height not that you're not you don't feel cramped on it the brakes again I think need to be a little bit better but when you couple the engine braking uh, it becomes they become pretty good when coupled together uh, I'm not hugely uh, confident in going into a turn fast granted this is a new bike so something I'd have to learn uh, just but right out of the box, you can feel that it needs a little better braking power. The power delivery is just phenomenal. You hit the gas, you hit the, put, roll the throttle on, and it just picks up and goes instantly. If you abruptly hit this throttle, <laughs> it can be harsh. But if you roll on it, it, it does exactly that. It just rolls on power, and it's everywhere. That's the beauty of electric motors. And like I said, you almost don't miss the engine sound with this motorcycle because you have all the other sounds to fill in for what you normally would hear. And you can still hear the transmission whine a little bit, so that works pretty good. I say all in all, the, the beauty of this motorcycle is and how it how it really just rides and the suspension is great that was kind of bumpy back there and it it held it down i didn't get bucked off or anything weird like that it was just comfortable i highly recommend those of you that are looking for an electric motorcycle to test out the zero srf because it is a truly
phenomenal machine. I am very impressed by this bike. And yeah, it's, it's incredible. I'm gonna pull over so Hef and I can switch. Um, I think he wanted to go all the way back, but I don't see the point in going all the way back. I think it's silly. We'll pull over here. So, ladies and gentlemen, I'm one of the other XRAM. If you like this video, please hit the like button. If you like it, subscribe. If you don't like it, don't subscribe. Actually, you don't subscribe anyways. You know you're going to like it. So you all have a good one. I'm going to hop off here. We're going to swap. I'm going to ride his bike. And he's going to have a go on this bad boy. You all have a good one. What do you think? That thing was gone.